Hi, my name is Joseph Kunuk. I'm born in King Island, uh, 1940. I raised there till 1956 and moved here in Nome. I've been around here for a long, long time and uh, done lots of changes, lots of changes. I used to carve every day before I start working again. I used to make little polar bear way back when I first started. They sell for a hundred bucks. I was kind of surprised at and, um, <laughs> and mom said, make some more. My education went up to eighth grade. Instead of going to high school, I started working. Got my mom and dad were in the hospital. There were two grocery stores in Nome and Front Street, the AC store and New U.S. Mountain Child. That's where I was working back then. My dad told me here, Wallace Tooth and a file, it's time to learn. We watch and learn. We, they don't teach us. We watch the people carve. That's how we learn. That's how I learned. Maybe I was nine or ten years old, I make a you know, a little tiny polar bear, a walrus. They laugh at it. I told them one of these days I'm going to be carving. There's a grocery store. They trade the carvings. They pay their bills with the carving. There's no cash around. I was um, 15, 16 years old. I never see cash before. Pay for groceries and bills. That's what I do. That's what I try to do, pay my bills with it. There's a bracelet I make. Uh, there's a man, woman face there, like native Eskimo, Eskimo faces. And I got polar bear, wall, uh, seal, and the walrus, the pie pieces. In between, I might use a uh, baleen or old ivory. I got set up in there what I'm gonna be doing. There's lots of people do lots of things like nothing but earrings, or little figurines, like little polar bear. They, I never see those before. I don't, I stopped seeing the little muskox. I make muskox once in a while. Earlier days, we'd go down to King Island or hunt right out here when the ice was around. It's lots of work when you catch walrus. They used to get lots of meat out of it. In summertime, everybody busy. Put away meat and everything else. Walrus stomach, they use it for drum, for the skin drum. And uh, the skin, female, like I told you, it's for the skin bone. They, they age it and take the skin off and hang it. And ladies will cut it in half. Ladies will cut it up, cook it, and put it away for the winter. Ivory, they harvest it. Then uh, they put it away, they divide it up and give it to hunters, you know. They could use it, they carve. That's how we live. When they go by in October up north, when we're down island, you could see nothing but walrus going down. It's just brown, orange color, flashing down, going, going south. Lots of walrus. I hate to see band banning ivory because there's more than me than other people that carve. I don't want to stop it. I just want to continue because they're younger generation that carve like what I'm doing. It's going to hurt lots of people, not only me.